The reason you love glitter probably comes from a really old survival instinct. Studies suggest that our attraction to shimmer could be an evolutionary trait from our ancestors, who needed to find shimmering bodies of water to survive. It's time to sprinkle a little substance into our beauty routines by learning the roots of your favorite trends, who history's earliest trendsetters were, and how to rock the looks they inspired. Sheet mask! Before it's over, you'll be asking, can I borrow that? And now for the history of glitter in under 60 seconds. Our Paleolithic elders weren't all work and no play. Flakes of mica can be found in cave paintings, adding an attractive shimmer to their artwork. Despite our prehistoric disposition to the stuff, modern glitter wasn't invented until 1934. Machinist Henry Rushman accidentally invented it when he found a way to grind up plastics. But people didn't start putting it on their bodies until decades later. In the 70s, artists like David Bowie drew inspiration for his Ziggy Stardust alter ego from drag shows and gay nightclubs, where glitter was a staple. And by the time Y2K hit, everything was dripping in glitter from bodies to hair and even Mariah Carey's film career. Glitter is an announcement demanding to not just be seen, but to shine brighter than anything or anyone around you. So it's no surprise that glitter is making a major comeback. Joining me for this tutorial is celebrity makeup artist and girl boss, Myla Thomas. Thank you so much, Myla, for doing this amazing face beat, because glitter can seem daunting. I think yeah. people avoid glitter, Absolutely. but it can be something that can just lightly add some shine to your life, right. or it can just take you there. We're gonna use a gel, okay. which is much easier than like a loose glitter. Amazing, so okay. this is the easy way yeah. to do glitter on your eyes. Right. I love this. Right. I, I love have this. two colors for you. We're gonna mix um, like a silver okay. and a lavender. Because right. what I like to do is layer okay. for dimension. And so this is kind of a look that I did recently for Met Gala on Nicki Minaj, and she had on like a pink dress, and we were going for like a Barbie doll look for her. Such a casual <laughs> sentence. Met Gala, Nicki Minaj. Okay. Yeah, it was so fun. It was super, super fun to do and super easy because we didn't have a lot of time either. I use my ring finger because you never want to put a lot of pressure on your eye. Your eye is very sensitive. Okay. And this just has the least amount of pressure. We, we use this in the beauty industry also to apply eye cream. I just learned about that on right. my Korean beauty episode. Okay. These are the fingers for eye cream Absolutely. for the same reason. Absolutely. And so the silver alone is really gorgeous because it right. kind of gives it like a glass look. Mm-hmm. Can and I just, peek? Absolutely. Oh yeah, see this? So that's so pretty, like just all natural, like yes. a natural eye. Second layer, okay. which is just as easy, but we're just gonna give a little dimension. I wanna pull in the beautiful purples you have on today. And the thing that I love about this is it seems like you don't have to worry about any fallout. You don't. You so don't. I love using a like glitter gel or liquid glitter option. <gasps> <laughs> so it's just a little hint of lavender. I love it. Do the same thing, the tapping motion, and just add it right in the corners of the eye. It's so glamorous and so pretty. When the light hits it, it looks like stars. Like stars are in the corner of your eyes. So cute. I want to know about what's safe for your eyes. So the difference between eye glitter and body glitter is the glitter has a round cylinder shape wow. so that it's not jagged. So if it gets in your eye, it's okay. It's not going to cut your eye. Mm -hmm. However, if the glitter is for the body specifically, they're not going to make sure that it doesn't have jagged edges. So just always look for something that says eye glitter. So I'm just gonna add a little bit to your cheeks and what okay. I'm gonna use for that are the glitter gels. But before I do that, I'm gonna give you a little bit more. I'm gonna layer this on top of your shimmer. What's the difference between shimmer and glitter? So shimmer is more finely milled. Okay. Okay, shimmer is uh, not as three-dimensional and it's gonna give you more of a wet look. Gonna add a little bit on your the high plants of your cheek, round it on your cheeks so when you smile, it's like ding. <laughs> The glitter gel we're gonna use today has like an iridescence. It has lavender, pink, and gold. Yes. But it's more three-dimensional. Okay. And it has stars and cylinders and different shapes. Okay, so why is this safe for both your body and your eyes, considering there are different shapes? There are stars here right. and other shapes in it. This is a gel form, so okay. it doesn't fall in your eyes. It's okay. Gonna stick and stay exactly where it's supposed to be. I'm gonna use my ring finger again. And this you wanna start off with a light yeah. layer, and then you can build. You have so many types of this product coming out because there's literally a surge in this trend. Glitter was super popular in like the 90s yeah. and then it kind of faded away and it now did. it's back. It's back. The way you apply it is very different from the 90s. 
Right. In the 90s, it was heavier and it was chunkier. Now, you go for more of a wet look. You go yeah. more of a glossy look. And It's I, back, but better. It's back, but better. I love that. So I have one layer okay. on your cheek. And the more I layer, the more dimensional it appears. Oh. <laughs> It's My so gosh, this is yeah. so beautiful. It's so gorgeous, I love it. Do you feel like your clients become more confident when you do their makeup or when you add mm -hmm. glitter into their look? Absolutely, especially when they think that I'm done and then I'm like, oh no, wait. One more step. I feel, you know I feel I mean? that. It's like, like you took me there. Yeah. Thank you so much, Myla, for doing yeah. my makeup, showing me all of the glitter ways. And Absolutely. I wanna know, what do you guys think? What would you start with with your glitter routine? Let us know in the comments below.